He got beef apparently. Last night on the Nightcap podcast with Shannon Sharp and Ocho Cinco, this happened. And I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna put this out there. Uh -huh. And this one, and I'm gonna fire this shot over your head, mofo. And you will know exactly who I'm talking about. Yeah. Mention my name. Mention my name again. Yeah. And I'm gonna put the DMs. I'm gonna put. I'm and I don't like doing this. Yeah. But you're lying. See, and yeah. I don't care about all that other stuff. You can say I'm gay, and you can say I'm. I don't care about that because yeah. I won't chase a lie. But yeah. I won't let you lie on my name. Yeah. Now you can say all that other stuff. I can deal with that. Mm -hmm. I don't look. I heard that a thousand times. Yes, Just sir. like everybody jumping in the chat talking about, oh, he don't like number white women. Right. I done dated a lot of different races. Yeah. Hey, listen, you like Skittles now. You eat every color. Come on, talk to me now. No, I don't Keep eat. On. I don't eat. Now I don't eat or suck. You they know, all you, do you, all that. You, you know what I mean? That's why I said I Skittles. Skittles. Okay. Okay. Stay. I'm, I'm with you. <laughs> you know, I, I look at Ocho. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, I'm telling, yeah. I'm, te I'm telling you this, and I want you, to, and I want somebody to send it to you. And y'all been, I've been seeing it in the chat. Y'all yeah. know who I'm talking about. I don't know who you talking about, say, but I'm with you. I'm a, nigga. Say I'm my name what? again, and I'm gonna put the, I'm a, and I'm gonna release the DMs because yeah. you're lying. Yeah, you said I reached out to you to come on Club Shay Shay, and you a mofo lie. Now when I, I, I see you, yeah, I'm gonna see you. I'm gonna see if you about that. Okay, I'm gonna see if you want to say what you've been saying on, yeah, trying to get some jokes. Because yeah. you got mad because Cat Williams did what he did. Mike Epps initially made a couple jokes about Shannon in the attempt to go viral because he admitted that Cat Williams' appearance on Shannon Sharp's show, he didn't mention Mike one way or the other. All right, I did get a little jealous, man. Cat broke the internet and didn't say my name, good or bad. I need the press too, nigga. Shit. <laughs> say something about me in there, man. <laughs> say something bad about me. I don't care. I got a special coming out. I need the press. Man, we did a movie together. So he made some jokes initially about that, but this right here is a totally separate incident. We're gonna play the video what Mike said here in a second. Now, now when I see you, yeah. I'm gonna see if you really about that. Yeah, and when I when I when I see you, nah, no, 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 no. I'm gonna no. see if him talking all that. Yeah, when he wore them tight ass leather pants, trying yeah. to be funny. Yeah, but I'm gonna see if you about that. Yeah, say my name again. Say, now be a. So and, be like yeah. Destiny's Child and talk about say my name, say my name. And I yeah. got something for your ass. Okay, I'm lost. I'm lost, but I'm with you. And whoever whoever you talking about it, we go, we go, what? Yeah. Yeah, I'm with Like I said, yeah. all that all for first of all, them saying I'm gay and this or that, it ain't affecting my bottom line. I'm, I'm gay. I've been happy for, for years. It don't it ain't affecting my bottom line. Now, if it'll start to affect my bottom line. Right. Then I'm gonna see. I'm gonna make y'all put. I'm gonna put you. Make you put your cars on the table. Yeah, it ain't gonna that's be no I'm flush gonna do. either. You ain't gonna. You ain't I'm gonna make you put no your cars on the table. But that don't bother me. Is that you lied, and you didn't have to. Say your little joke. Get your little laugh off. Have fun, but just don't lie and said I said something right. when I didn't. And you know who you are, mofo. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm calling you a mofo now. Yeah. When I see you. Boy, I promise you, I'm gonna pull up. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna we, pull up, and yeah. I'm gonna see if you bought that. Cause yeah. I'm, I'm about it with you. Me too. As soon as now, I get on probation, y'all know I don't Chet's like I said. Talking. I stay to myself, Ocho. Anybody yeah. tell you I got, yeah. a, I got, I'm not, and I never, and I said it. I say when people say, "Man, that's not like Shannon." That's exactly who Shannon was. Mm -hmm. I let my guard down. Right. I'm gonna see you. Yeah, I don't know what we talk about. I'm gonna see you too. Let me take my glasses. I'm off. I'm gonna see you. We both gonna see you. Yeah, mofo. Fuck. Now, if you really want me, send for me. Ooh. I'll come. Yeah. Now, I'm, when I'm coming out, look here. I got special handling. I come yeah. with shipping and handling because yeah. I'm gonna make sure you get it. Yeah. Make sure you put your address, nigga. Shit, we'll be there. No, nah, just day. Hey. And don't come. Hey, man, you know, no, no, because I, I, I'm gonna tell you what somebody told me one time. What is joke to you is death to somebody else. Don't lie on my name. Say what you want to say about me. I wear all. I wear all that, but don't lie on me. And that is Shannon Sharp's response to some jokes that Mike Epps had been telling recently on stage, and it sounds like Uncle Shannon got a whiff of it. <laughs> that nigga Shannon Sharp called me trying to do an interview. I said, "No, Medea, I ain't doing no interview." <laughs> So you can sit across from me and look at my balls. I'm sitting down, nigga. I thought he was going to attack Cat, that nigga there. <laughs> nigga, shit is called Shay Shay. The nigga's telling you. 
put a wig on that nigga and tell me if that ain't motherfucking Medea's sister, nigga. They exposing every motherfucking body. They got T.D. Jakes fucked up. Now that's fucked up. All that money that nigga didn't got from God, and they didn't came out on him. And I get what Shannon was saying. He didn't like the fact that Mike lied and said that Shannon called Mike trying to get him on the podcast, opposed to it actually being Mike DM and Shannon trying to get on this podcast. But those things are jokes. I get that. Shannon may say that he's more upset about that than anything, but I don't think it's that. I think it's way too many people, and I just mentioned this on my podcast just a few hours ago when we live streamed. There's way too many people that got really comfortable calling that man gay. And I think he probably done had his limit. Here's a here's a clip from Mike Epp responding to Shannon Sharp. He just released not even two hours ago from the time that I'm recording this. Let's see it. Now, I know Shay Shay. I don't know what grown ass man got a name named Shay Shay, but I know this grown man is not mad at me. So many people talk crazy about you. They was on Saturday Night Live talking about you, imitating you, but now you want to fight me? Now, I'm not going to lie. I did DM you to get on the show. But I DM'd you to get on the show because you brought my name up when you were sitting there with Cat. And he was trying to get him to talk crazy about me, but he didn't. Okay? Now, second of all, talking about pulling up on me. You're going to be an all-star. I'm going to be at the all-star in my hometown. And I'm going to see you. All right? I'm going to see you, brother. And I'm just letting you know, I don't be doing no fighting lately. I don't do no fighting. So, you know, there's only other one other option. If you don't fight, you do blank, 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 blank. And Ocho, you shut up and go get some eyebrows. You looking like a whole milk dud sitting there agitating. We watched the white boy kick your ass on TV. So you shut up. And Shay Shay, you did look like Medea sitting there. You was looking zesty. I'm not saying you gay, but you was looking zesty. You look like Big Frida sitting there. You need to take them tight ass shirts off with the muscles. And that's it. <laughs> Go check out my special February the 20th on Netflix. February 20th on Netflix is called I'm Ready to Sell Out. Because being a real dude ain't making no money right now. And it stated clearly that his problem with Mike wasn't that Mike was calling him gay and that stuff. It was that he lied about Shannon contacting him to be on Club Shay Shay when in reality it was Mike DMing Shannon to be on this podcast. I'm not one of those super sensitive people or anything like that. I think majority of stuff jokes is jokes. We all know as men that there's that line you don't cross. And I think just calling a man gay, I think if you're a straight man that crosses the line. Maybe I'm wrong man, let me know in the comments. So who do you guys think is right? You think Shannon Sharp being too sensitive? Do you think Mike Epps is in the right? Let me know in the comments. I believe that Cat Williams is somewhere laughing hysterically. Do better squad. All out.